You're sitting in darkness apart from Christ. You think you might have it all. You think you're okay. But apart from Christ, you are in darkness. You are sitting in darkness in your sin, lost from him. And here that light shines through and pierces the darkness. From that time forth, Jesus began preaching, saying, repent for the kingdom of heaven is at hand. That's the gospel. That's the hope for the darkness that we're in is the coming of Christ. He's the one who breaks through that darkness of sin. He overcomes sin. He defeats sin. He's He is our Savior. It begins here in Luke when he talks about the shepherds coming. The shepherds are here at night. There's night tending their flock. And that light and that glory of the Lord has shone all around them. And what do they say? They say, we have come to you. I bring, the angel said, I bring good news of great joy that will be for all the people. That good news is what? That's the gospel. That's euangelion. That's the word, man. That's that's what it means. That's the good news of salvation, of, of, of hope, of forgiveness of sins. And he says, I bring good news to you of great joy. And the word is megas, great. You know, mega. That's what we get. I, this is, it's not just good news of, you know, joyful news. This is good news of great joy. Megas Kairos, great joy. It's unprecedented. It's beyond anything you can imagine. And who's it for? It's for all the people. That's what this news is for. That's why we tell people about Christ. It's for every person everywhere. Why? Because this is the only way of salvation. That's why it's good news. You can't find your way out of darkness. You can't work your way to the Lord out of that. You're Unto us is born this day, right now, right here, he's saying to him. That's the light in the darkness. This little baby in the manger. That's the light that breaks through and pierces the darkness. Because who is he? He's the Savior. Soter is, is the word. That means deliverer. Christ, Christ delivers us. You can't deliver yourself. You can't find your way out of sin, out of that darkness. He's the one who does it. He delivers us from our sin, Satan, death, and hell. There's no way that we can do it on our own. He's Christ. That's, that's, the type, that's Messiah. That means he's the anointed one, the, the hopeful one, the expected one, the only one in whom there's salvation. There's no other name under heaven on earth at which we might be saved. So here, here he is. He's the Savior, the Christ, to be born to us. You can't run to another religion. You can't run to another philosophy. You can't run to yourself. That's not going to work. That's not going to do. That's not going to get you out of the darkness, out of sin. Only he can. Christ Jesus, who is the Lord, kurios, that's supreme ruler, authority, our master. He has power. He's the one with the power, guys, over Satan, sin, death, and hell. We don't have the power to overcome the darkness. We don't. That's why he came. He does. So he is our king, right? And he subdues us to himself. We don't find him. He subdues us. He he rules and defends us as our Savior, as our Master. He cares for us. He watches over us. He defeats his and our enemies. That's what the angel's saying here, man. He is Savior Christ the Lord. He's the one. He's the light in the darkness. I love that picture and that metaphor because there's such just such a contrast to where we are, where we're at, to who we could be and are in Jesus Christ. 